Bitcoin gold is not with one hour chart. And if you refer to what analyzers, we're expected to see one more drop. And this is what we get because I mentioned since the price was here, I mentioned at least we can expect to see one more drop. This is what we get. And right now, what we're looking for, we're looking for the reversal. It doesn't mean if we get any opportunity for buy, we will take it because this is what we have been looking for. Any opportunity for buy as a reversal, as a short move flag or having a tree above here, we will take it. And the targets we're looking for based on one hour chart is 50 flowing by 56. Anyway, we adjust the target. If you refer to my last analysis, it's different from my last analysis. And if anyone wants to look for buy by having a trip of this, we should know that we want the price sharply tag break and continue with the price tag. This is not moving. We shouldn't keep the trade more than two hours. All right, having a trade there above here, above here, it depends on the traders. But what I'm looking for, I'm looking for buy from here. If I get any reversal, any opportunity for buy, we'll take it. We are not really interested to look for sell, okay? And if even we can expect this one tend to flag a correction for one more drop. But as I mentioned, I'm not really interested to look for sell at this point. If I want to look for sell, I prefer to get one more wop. If the VC, the prices couldn't break the previous top, then any opportunity for sell from there, we will take it. This is where we can look for sell because we can consider this one in relative to this one next drop. That's why if we get any opportunity for buy within in this range, we will take it. And we need to see the breakout of the previous top. And this is the targets we're looking for. But if you get any opportunity for buy or any reversal, it turns to a corrective move. Then we should know how to manage the trade. Then any sell from there, we take it. All right. We are more interested to look for buy. And even if the price can continue to drop as a corrective, we just let it go. We are not really interested to look for sell at this point. I explained where we can look for sell. And if we move to higher time frame, we move to daily chart. We mentioned we're looking for the reversal. And this is what we're looking for as a long term. And the targets we can look for is 105 following by 125. But based on daily chart, we don't see any reversal point. And still, we can expect the price consolidated here before, for longer time before we see the reversal. That's why if we get any opportunity for buy based on lower time frame, we'll take it. But we should know how to manage it if it doesn't move in our direction. And if we move to forward charts, we have nothing to discuss. And everything is similar to what we have discussed based on one hour chart. And... Right now, I'm looking at this. Any trade for buy, we'll take it. And this is the targets I'm looking for. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.